The Australian Department of Defense has confirmed that the lead ship of the Anzac-class frigates of the Royal Australian Navy, the H Anzac FFH-150, will not be sailing anymore and despite unofficial, it is technically and effectively like saying the ship is retired from service as of February 19, 2024, according to Max Defense. Again, and I need to re-emphasize this. The DND and the Philippine Navy should consider inquiring with the Australian Department of Defense and see if it is possible to transfer the ship to the Philippine Navy, considering the common interest of deterring aggression in the region and working with like-minded countries and considering the Philippines is a strategic partner of Australia. The HMS Anzac FH-150 is 30 years younger than the Philippine Navy's BRP Gregorio del Pilar, has a far better sensor suite and weapon system than even the PN's most modern ship the BRP Jose Rizal, as it is equipped with the CFR phased array radar and a towed array sonar, as well as the MK-41 VLS for evolved Sea Sparrow missiles, and is far better and larger than any existing or upcoming warship of the Philippine Navy despite its age of 28 years. The Anzac class are younger and more capable than the Pohang class corvettes that the Philippine Navy is pursuing from South Korea and uses diesel engines through Kodog propulsion layout which the Philippine Navy can be happy with. I hope this time the Philippines will not let another good opportunity from Australia to pass again, like when it let the Adelaide class frigates go to Chile. Remember, knowledge is power.